Hey guys, so it's Saturday morning and we're still in San Francisco of course and today we're gonna retry the Chinatown of course and well, we never know what we're gonna do. So we're just gonna figure out while we go and of course we'll take you guys behind the closed doors with us. And there's Anna Week. Hello! <laughs> okay, so enjoy today's episode guys. And you see the flag in the back? We are really there. The first thing we always start in the morning is our app Rambler. Because this app will actually track where we go all day long. And you can download it as GPX information and actually use that in Lightroom to sync your images. Now if you go to our website and you go to the video I created called Beyond Snaps, you see some nice explanation about this and a lot more about travel and street photography of course. So let's start. There we go. And we're ready to go. Breakfast in a new place just opened up and it's very good. So if you're in the neighborhood, make sure to check them out. Really nice. Okay, this time we found a parking spot and we're ready to go into Chinatown. For the girls and for the boys. Okay, when you're at Union Square, make sure to go to the top floor of Macy's to the ch Cheesecake Factory. Great cheesecakes, of course, but great view of San Francisco. So on top, at Macy's Cheesecake Factory, for an amazing view for you guys who love photography. And who doesn't, right? One of our favorite bookstores, whenever visiting the US, we always shop here for some nice discount books. But not too much, because we have to take them home with us, of course. So let's go in and see if they have something cool. Maybe they will have my book. Okay, and what do they have in topics in technology? Yes, mastering the model shoot by me. Awesome. Found these really cool Batman and Joker figurines at the Barnes and Nobles. Couldn't resist. They're cute. <laughs> Now for traveling around we use an app called TomTom Go and it's a pretty awesome app. I believe you pay 19 euros a year and then you have free updates and it works worldwide and it downloads all the maps. Now that sounds awesome right? And it actually is. It's a really good navigational system and on the iPhone 6s Plus it runs amazingly. The only problem is uh, while part of our group was actually at Macy's and I didn't want to go. I tried to find some comic book stores. Yeah, we tried four, and all four were closed, or we ended up in an industrial area where there was nothing else going on. So yeah, TomTom Go. Make sure that you update your maps because, well, it's pretty ridiculous, right? So yeah, not a good thing. Anyway, we're going to have some dinner and then we turn in for tonight and we'll see you guys tomorrow in Behind the Closed Doors.